I feel that what we've done is great, but we also need to remember that this is an issue that has to continue and especially continue until November because if what we're doing doesn't have any impact come November, nothing would have mattered that we've done. I just hope that everybody today gets out, registers to vote, and come November, they have to vote if not for themselves, for the kids. Uh, we just walked out of school and we're here to show our support with Columbine and we're here saying that enough is enough. This should have stopped with them and now it's transitioned over to our school. It's been 19 years and nothing has changed and we need change now. Everybody is free to sign this. We will send this to them. What I think is so cool about um, this event specifically is this is a collaboration of a, a multitude of different organizations. So I'm a part of Students Demand Action DMV, um, which is a group of it's of hundreds of a few hundred students and we're from all over the DC area who and we are all united in the fact that we need to make change in that gun violence the status quo of gun violence uh, we don't want that to continue in our country and we need to show that students we have power as individuals and while many of us can't vote yet we our voices still need to be heard. So I just find it ridiculous that kids don't feel safe here in America um, I'm here because I believe in the legislative process um, I'm a, I love America and I love our democracy and I think it's probably one of the most amazing countries in the world um, but my problem right now is that our representatives aren't representing us and what we believe. Um, so I think that when democracy isn't working for you, um, that's when you have to come out and say something. And we have to keep saying something until they actually listen because we've been, for the past few months we've been protesting, we've been out here and nothing has changed. We've demonstrated many times that this is what students want, this is what the world wants, and Congress is refusing to act. So I think we need to be out here every week, every day, until they do something about it. We're marching because innocent lives are taken by guns every single day. And you know, I've heard, why are you guys doing a second walkout? It's because gun violence hasn't been solved since the first one.